Welcome to Is It a Good Idea to Microwave This? I'm your host, Jory Karen. I'm your host, Jory Karen. And this is an eye dog. It was donated by the Gil Martin twins or Liam Jerry. We had two of them. Yeah. So, I mean, this dog's pretty cool, you know, like you can, you can feed it, I'm guessing, and it's like all happy. And then if you grab it by its tail, it just wants to rip your head off. And then and then you just can't settle this thing down. And I have to put it in my microwave to get rid of it. Is it a good idea to microwave this? Let's find out. Here at the Jory Karen Laboratory, safety is our number one concern. And that's why we hide behind this giant tinfoil shield to protect our nuts. Because, no, seriously, you have to stop making noise when I'm doing intros. We also have these fans circulate the air, and as always, our Panasonic microwave. You didn't say sharp. I'm glad. I'm very, very proud. I of know. You. I, was, I thought I was about to. I thought I was gonna say it too. Honestly. Her name's Whoopi. Whoopi. Oh. Whoopi. 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 Okay. Whoopi. So. Whoa. Okay. In goes I dog. I dog. Oh, that's smell. smell. It's gonna become I smoke in a minute. Sure, he's riled up. Okay. And uh, I'm gonna put her in there for four <laughs> minutes. Kennel up. My <laughs> uh, dog's away. My dog is away. I it's predict, already I making I predict there will be time. fire within the minute. Within the minute? Within the first minute. His ears are oh. glowing. Oh dear. It's like a... Oh dear. Oh, it's shaking its head. <laughs> oh, I don't like this. It's not shaking its head anymore. <laughs> oh, yeah, but smoke's coming out of its head. Dog. Folks, if your dog has smoke coming from its head, Time to adopt consult, a new one. Consult a veterinarian immediately, as this may be a sign of a, a bigger problem. You might have to put him down. Yeah, you'll definitely have to put him down. <laughs> then again, it's so smoky right now, it might not catch fire at all. Dude, where there's smoke, there's always fire. Oh, there's fire. My point all has right. been proven. Okay. Here comes right. the fire extinguisher, baby. Here comes the sun. Oh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Door. Wait. Wait for it and go. Three okay. and two. Two oh, and two is really hurt right now. And I've got this dog that looks like Droopy Snoopy right here. Oh man, it actually gave him kind of like spots. He looks like a Dalmatian now. Black burn spots. Can you face this? Oh, oh, I see how that works. So you want a black lab or? Oh, you just snapped his face off. <laughs> he has like metallic around his. You just snapped his head off. <laughs> So you may be wondering, is it a good idea to microwave an eye dog? And I mean, I really don't think it's a good idea to have an eye dog. If you want eye but, burning. Yeah, if you want eyes to burn, maybe. Eye dog equals eye but, burn. Um, I'm going to say it's not a good idea to buy them, and it's not a good idea to microwave them either. It's it's just not a good idea. So that's about it for it. Is it a good idea to microwave this? I'm your host, Jory Karen. So things. we found this pattern. When there's a battery still in it and it explodes, it's bad for your our eyes. eyes burn. Very so we got it vent out for like a minute or five. It's been about five minutes. So let's so go, let's back, go in there. back in there. And I can't see a damn thing. Are your eyes still burning now? I can't see a damn thing. Shut the f up, dog. Shut up. Shut up. <laughs>